Hey guys. Uh, A, did I almost forget to do the weekly wrap up? Yeah, yes, I did. Judge me. Big thing I found out this week, though, after listening the other day, I realized that my live streams sound fine. It's only my videos that sound off. So I've quit fiddling with the microphone settings in Elgato and realized that the difference between the two is one is on StreamYard and one is on OBS, and it was probably my OBS settings that were messing up my audio. Made a couple of tweaks. Hopefully this turns out better. We'll see how it goes. What did I read last week? Well, I finished absolutely nothing. Uh, I did make some headway on Brain Dump. Uh, good family? I want to say good family. Age can made a little Made a little headway there. Uh, I did also get some more of uh, We Were Birds. I believe that's how it said. Knocked out. But most of the way, I'm almost done with the new Josh Mallerman book. I want to say it's Incidents Around the House. It's an audio book, so I don't have it in front of me. That one I'm almost done with. That, that, one, that one, I don't have a review for it yet, for it yet, but that one's going to be pretty good. I'm just saying. Unless it, the ending sucks, that's a good book. So not a lot done on the reading front, or at least nothing completed. Got some reading in, didn't get anything finished. However, it was not still a bad week because yesterday, if you haven't already seen it, we got to talk to Jen Lyons. She's got a new book dropping July 9th, so got to discuss that, discussed her writing a little bit, and uh, yeah, found out what's coming down the pipe. So yeah, she's already working on another book that's going to be coming out, but you're going to have to watch the interview for that. No cheaties, I'm not telling you. You'll just have to watch. And then this week, like I said, definitely should be done with incidents around the house. I don't, you know, let me just find out how far am I into that book? Because it is an audio book. All right. Looks like I am 75% through that book. That's definitely going to get finished this week because I barely started it last week. And of course, tomorrow, uh, noon central, one o'clock Eastern. If you want, you can come hang out with Paul Jessup and me. We are going to be discussing Elizabeth Hand's Wilding Hall. I know I called her Emily last time. Sorry, Elizabeth. Uh, and also The Wicker Man from the 1970s. Uh, with Edward Woodward, and whatever else comes to our mind. Uh, so we're going to hang out. Like It starts at noon, probably going to hang out for an hour, hour and a half, two hours, you know, whenever the wife comes in and, and turns off my computer. Uh, we'll see how that goes. So that's going to be next week, and that is it. The next big thing I've got coming up is probably not till next month. I don't have a date yet. We do have the Sarah Reese Brennan conversation coming up. And pretty much that's it. Uh, like I said, right now, I'm just spending a lot of my free time either working on the house or uh, working a second job to pay for the house. So, yeah, uh, give us another month or two and things should hopefully get back to normal. And I'll also be in a different office. Something that'll look a little bit nicer than this, hopefully. We'll see how it goes. That is it. Most exciting thing last week was getting to talk to Jen. And uh, then the most exciting for next week is probably uh, going to be talking to Paul. So there we go. And reading, of course. I will get some reading done. I promise. Just just, just can't sit down for two or three hours a night and, and read a book right now. So we'll get back to normal at some point. Uh, so anyhow, like I said, also next week, I've been waiting till we talk to Paul, but I will get, if you follow me on Goodreads, I will get the uh, review up for Wilding Hall. I just didn't want to give anything away before the book talk tomorrow. And then, of course, I will definitely also uh, finish the Mallerman one up. That one, when does Incidents Around the House drop? That should be coming out. I want to say it's coming out soon. That comes out June 25th. So I will get that review up in time for you to take a look at it before the book actually comes out. Uh, shout out to Libro.fm for letting me listen to that early. I always appreciate it. And that is pretty much it. And now, now I get to stop this and listen to see if the audio is any better. Uh, take care, guys. Hope you have a bunch of five-star reads. And like I said, hope uh, to see some of you tomorrow. Noon. Noonish. If you're in the central time zone. You can do the math for there. I'm not listing them all out. All right.